Now to the latest in the road to fully reopening South Florida, lifting curfews, allowing restaurants to welcome more customers and allowing fans to return to major sporting events. Officials are working toward normalcy. Well, after more than a year of COVID-19 safety restrictions, what does normalcy actually look like and when is that going to happen? CBS 4's Joe Murray is live in Fort Lauderdale with more and it's great that we're actually talking about this, isn't it, Joan? Yeah, and here we are on Los Alas, Elliot, more than a year after it all began when things were shutting down. Well, a lot has changed in that year, but we're still not where we need to be, and reopening is a work in progress. Sure, we all want the pandemic to be over after a year of lost lockdowns and limitations, but in South Florida, the infection rate is around 8%. People are still getting sick and dying. I mean, I think people are just getting, uh, you know, quote unquote, uh, quarantine fatigue at this point. Um, you know, we're, we're at a year. We spoke to the cafe owners of a new business on Los Olas in Fort Lauderdale that opened two months ago. Honestly, most people don't even talk about it anymore. You know, uh, in the store, it's really just about, you know, people enjoying their day, going about, seeing the water, going on a run, um, whatever it may be. And I, I do think even the conversation of it is kind of subsiding to begin with. And while throughout Broward, it may look like things are back to normal, technically it's not. On Tuesday, Broward's mayor targeted possibly May 1st for reopening, but only if certain conditions are met. Half the adult population is fully vaccinated, and the positivity rate has to be under 5% for 10 consecutive days. If that happened, social distancing at hotels would vanish, and there would be no capacity limits at restaurants, retail stores, and non-pro sporting events. In Miami Dade, it's a completely different story. On Monday, the midnight curfew will go away. We was really tired to stay at home, but really happy now that we can have fun. And the county has now fully opened retail and commercial establishments. As long as people are wearing masks, the stores have sanitizers, and everyone keeps six feet apart. COVID, I'm definitely scared of it, but I'm vaccinated, so I'm happy to be out and uh, doing my thing and being able to be a tourist again. But don't be making your cruise plans anytime soon. The CDC still has not signed off on sailings, although we are told there are ongoing negotiations to possibly have sailings midsummer. Still a lot of rough waters ahead in those negotiations with the cruise industry and the CDC. So you heard the mayor here in Broward. He wants a 50 percent vaccination rate among adults before we really see a full reopening. But we are still under 20 percent. So there's a lot of ground to make up in these weeks down in Miami Dade. The vaccination rate overall is also just under 20 percent. Reporting live in Fort Lauderdale tonight, Joan Murray, CBS 4 News.